Hey guys, welcome back to more Novice. Hope you're all doing very well. The last time we left off, we did a couple of errands around the college, uh, handed in a couple of quest lines, and we even enchanted our very first sword. Look at us, we are doing incredibly well. Well, now the time has come to come and deliver that, that enchanted sword, and I have no idea how far it is we actually have to go. Where, where do we have to go? Kind of getting worried that I'm not seeing it in the immediate vicinity. Oh, you tell me it's like all the way down here. Oh, it's Crow's Tooth Camp. Thank God. Obviously, it's not going to be there. Do we even have it marked? Let's double check that. Oop, whoops. Yeah, we got it marked. All right. Hmm. Where, where do you have to go to deliver this thing? It's Winterfrost Cottage. Oh, gee, it's all the way over there. Oh, man. <laughs> Gotta take a trip through the mountains so I can go to Snow Point Beacon and take it on from there on foot. Oh, well, the good thing is we got food and water on us, so we're gonna be absolutely fine, and we're just gonna hope that we don't freeze to death. Uh, speaking of which, a little bit of a drink. Cooked potatoes, yeah, why not? A little bit of salmon and all that good stuff. Right, let's get the hell out of here. Actually, while we're beginning our trek, if you haven't already, be sure to hit the like and sub button. It would mean a lot to me if you could do that. We also have a Patreon in the description below as well. Thank you. Right. Straight to Snow Point Beacon. And we'll go on foot the rest of the way. And we'll see what kind of um, shenanigans we end up running into, if any. Oh, pitch black. Sick. Right, well, thank God for the lantern. Now then. Which way are we going? Ah, we're going about a kilometer this way, right? Are we, like, on the side of a mountain full on? Yeah, it would appear so. Time to begin the evening. Half ten, right, well... I don't know what the um, actual day-night cycle is. Could be 24 minutes for all I know, but we're just going to uh, we're just going to go, and hopefully we get there. It's going to be uh, you know a little bit brighter out. The sun will be rising. Yeah, we're already freezing. We're kind of in a bit of a I wouldn't really call it a blizzard, but it's a minor snowstorm. We need to definitely be quick. There's somebody here. Oh shit, we came into a bandit camp. Okay, that's good. I can barely see them. They're not gonna hit a thing, man. The velocity on those fireballs is just way too slow. How many of them are in there, though? For that, we do not know. All kind of within our uh, levels, though. Level 15 to 10, I mean, that's pretty alright. Is that a hit? Ooh, just... Just shy. We got shot, though. Christ. Right, let's back it up a bit behind the tree. We'll heal up. Now, having said that, we don't necessarily need to fight them. That's not a thing that we need to do here. But... Eh... It's XP at the end of the day. See, I don't know, I'm not sure. I'm actually not sure. Hmm. Yeah, don't know. We'll see what we can do. Oh, shot again. Oh, not ideal. Ah. We're just gonna go around, screw us. Don't care. We get XP for healing ourselves anyway. Fort Felm Hammer, okay. Is there a guy directly behind me? No, but I think we've, um... Yeah, we skirted them anyway. It's way too dark. It's not a fight I can take right now. Leave him be for the time being. At the very least, ooh! Is that an arrow coming my way? I thought so. I'm not sure, actually. Hmm. Oh, shit, what the hell? Oh, there are spiders out here. I can hear them. Oh, there's one. Okay, they're tiny. We'll deal with that. Ugh. Ugh. Get out of here. Ugh. Oh. Well, this isn't uh, her house or anything, but... What have we come upon? Their home, perhaps? It could even be, uh, oh, it could even be a fully fledged uh, town. Hang on. Where are we? Hello? 
Dumpar Wall. Oh, nice to see a friendly face, even if you are a Nord. Yes. Yeah, but life for standing guard now, but then again, this could be the most uh, dangerous um, shift of the of all, really. Well, at least we can actually uh, cozy up, though. Stay a bit warm now. Should be a brazier up here, if I remember correctly. I think we've been here before in a previous uh, playthrough. Gun Gunther's glamorous gifts, eh? Hmm. Well, I think there actually is an inn here as well, so what we could do... Oh. Hail her Terror. Okay, that would be the Terror. I kind of want to check that out. I was about to say, if there is an inn here, we could actually uh, get a room and sleep until daybreak. Lack of visibility is, um, quite frankly, dangerous. Hello? Yes. All right, then. So, what is it that you uh, guard in here, then? Steal from chest, steal from empty chest. That chest is actually not empty, though. Oh, God, we have no lockpicks. Note to self, uh, buy lockpicks or find them or do whatever I can to get more. Get like some type of conjuration spell going and conjure them in. Oh, the crypt. Obviously, I do not have the key. Alrighty. You know what? Fair enough. Well, there has to be more to the tower than the crypt, right? Can we go up higher? We should be able to. Oh! I'm okay. I'm okay. Just saw there the heat is currently warming me, so yeah, that's decent. What the hell did I fall through? I came out- I came out here, no? Oh my god, that- There is no collision detection there. I can fall right through. I don't know where that guard went, he probably fell down himself. Either way, get that fixed. Ah, we're talking, aren't we? <laughs> Hello? Not now. Okay, not now, okay. I've got my eye on you. Hey, dude, man, I'm just here to keep warm. I'm also, uh, interested in what this, uh, tower has to offer. I mean, it has this thing to offer. I can worship back in Oh, there are a lot of, um... A lot of, uh, sigils here that we can worship on. What if we go higher, though? Oh, hello. A little blacksmithy up here as well. These guys, I mean, no guardrails. I mean, fucking yes. hell. Where the hell's the health and safety around here now? Do you, do you not have any? Is there like a spare bed? Crest, all owned. My NPCs are in here. My god, alright. What about a nice little target range? Cool, cool, cool. Is that it? Are we as high as we can go? Yeah, I guess so. Very cool, a nice little tower. Oh, no, no, we can go higher. I mean, this tower looked massive from the outside, so it's good to see that, you know, the scale is actually proportional. So, what are we in here now? The mess hall? Well, you look like royalty, but who are you? Goodbye. But no, we should talk to them, shouldn't we? Good to know that they leave priceless valuables out in the open like that. Hello, who are you? What do you think you're doing? Time to go. Mm -hmm. Can't talk to the guy, but he is a pale heart. Must be a royal family. Well, not necessarily a royal family, but a noble family. And I have your perfect emerald, haha! -ha. Alright, let's go. Uh, how the hell do we get back down here again? Oh, yes. I mean, this tower itself probably houses, uh, roughly 30 or so people, I would say. Cool little area, though, I like it. Oh, you have some visibility, actually. What's this? What kind of door is that? That's like plate steel almost. Main thing I'm looking for those in in. How about here? 
Ah, there we are, silent nice. Oh, holy nice. Now, if I recall correctly, these are very, very tiny rooms, yeah? Which we don't actually have access to because all the beds are fucking owned, oh my dear. We can't necessarily sleep on the floor though, can we? Unless we were to build up camp. Oh. This though we do need. Ah, hang on. I'm gonna talk to you now. Yes. Uh, room please. I put that on if I were you as well. Thank you. Now the problem is- oh, yes. Of course. Refill my bootles and uh... Yeah, we're, we're not hungry. I'll show you to your room, right this way. Hey, appreciate it. Nice to actually travel here during the day. Ugh. Said it many times before, but I can feel the cold emanating through my, uh, through my screen. Oh, here we are. Jail cell. Yours for a night. If anything, it would be quite cozy. Thank you. Goodbye. Can we Come sleep? Come on in. Just stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. Can't sleep while being asked to leave. Don't you ask me to leave? Get out of here. Go back. Go back to your. Go back to your post. Thank you. Unbelievable. The gall of him to tell me to get out. I paid for the room. Right then. Seven hours. Get me up to eight a.m. Perfection. What's this? Holds of Skyrim. I think I've read that before. Loyal officer of the Empire. In time. In time. Uh, of course, we got Falkreath, Offengar, Yalmarch, the Pale, the Reach, the Rift, Whiterun, and Winterhold. Winterhold, of course, being the uh, the best one. That's where we live. Ah. Oh, what a beautiful morning. Oh, what a beautiful day. All right, let's go. Now that we can actually see where we're going, in fact, we could even uh, pop back and clear out that uh, bandit camp on the way back. But we're close enough now to actually um, deliver that sword. We might as well push on. I'm very interested, though, to see what this Hall of the Vigilant is all about. And ah, yes, another one of those. Oh, well, we found it. Might as well... Uh, toggle it or uh, proc it. There. Not immersion ruining at all. Oh, dearie me. That was uh, very good. Well, somebody had their way with the hall. Hmm. Yes. Sky Shards and Skyrim the Pale. Right. Quite a lot on you, my friend. Quite a lot indeed. Not seen anything remotely enchanted though, but I will take that book. I will take your lockpicks. What are you doing with- oh, you're a vampire, okay. It's obviously a vampire attack. Another vampire? Again, they don't wear armor, do they? <laughs> like, Jesus. Take that recipe, absolutely. God, on the table and everything, they're probably having their, uh, oh! Oh, just girl's plate. Hello, what do we found here? What's this? I'm trying to get on the table so I can have a better look at it. Well, the best way to have a look at it would be to uh, look at it uh, thusly. Let's see. If we just type in plate, it's a tribunal plate. Marwind expansion pack, I like that. Ah, oh, the Ethereum Wars. Yeah, definitely investigate further. I'm gonna take that. Well, 
You put up a good go of it. You took down a couple of vampires. Ooh, Legions of the Dead reminds me of the Dragon Age armor. You put up a very good go. You made a very good go of it. You put up a very good fight. But alas, you lost. Oh well. At the very least, you can all say you did your duty. All right, let's go. So she lives up uh, this mountain then, right? Of course, we have traveled quite a far way, a uh, long way from home. Furthest away we have been from home in this uh, playthrough so far. In fact, if I recall correctly, there should be an interesting, um, an interesting dungeon up here. But for now, we're looking for the sword. Well, looking for the house to deliver the sword, I should say. She is kind of... Okay, it's actually turned out to be below us. It's not up this mountain at all, right? That's silly of me. I will say, though, when we get dragons uh, turned on, having a dragon fight up there is going to be absolutely beyond the realm of epic. Hmm. Yeah, it's time to... Okay, we're on... Okay, we're level with the house now, apparently. Oh, another one of those things, right. Well, she must have one right outside the house, then. Oop. Yeah, oop. Right. Are we here? Yes, we are here. Lovely. A oh, nice little humble hamlet, actually. A full-on uh, village. Of course, they made this so awkward to get to. Thank you. Yalmarch. Very good. Witness to a horrifying caravan ambush, perched atop a mine amidst the Hill of Stones. Oh, there's a mine right here. Hello, hello, one and all. You're known to me now, scum. Remember that. What, just because I'm a... <laughs> right then. No, just because I'm a, I'm a Khajiit? Some different from you? God damn you, man. Need something? No, nothing. Just wanting to see can I talk to anyone here. I like your robes. Are you a sorcerer from the college? You charm my horse. I'm in need of your crafting expertise. Could you upgrade my equipment? Okay, you're a blacksmith. Yeah, I. It's more magic that we need. So where is her house? Is she within the mine? She is within the mine. Okay, to the mine we go. Who knows, maybe the fire sword will make for a very good pickaxe. Hello. Well, look what we have here. Another wizard. Great. What do you want? Uh, I'm here to deliver the enchanted sword you asked for. A sword? What? No. But... Ah, I see now. My daughter Adara, she's gonna get a sit down later. So, you need to leave now. Go. Wait, what? Are you telling me your daughter ordered it without without you knowing? Oh my word. I'm worried about my daughter. Where the fuck is your daughter? <laughs> Find the actual client. Are you shitting me? God damn it. Let's get the hell out of here. None here, is she? I'd say not. Oh man. What do you want? Hello, Tiba. Until next time. If I recall correctly, this is uh, kind of like a weird mine. Seems to me only women doing the work. You lost. All right then. A very a very old woman at that. That seems uh a bit wrong in my eyes, but oh well. Oh. Yes. What is it? What's your business here? Uh, I'm just right, exploring. Then. No need to be so. Uh, there's absolutely no need to be so um, suspicious all the time. Now that does look like silver, but it's probably just going to be iron. Going to be platinum. That just wants makes me want to play Terraria. Oh, I thought that was staff. Hello, a leviathan garnet. And I can just take that, can I? It's out in the open, is it? Yoink. Thank you. That is insane. You know, when we eventually buy a player home, that that's gonna be that's gonna be a centerpiece right there.
What are you doing that for? Hey, I'm trying to get out of here, buddy. Gotta find a real client, apparently. Well, it's her daughter, but she did say, oh, where is my daughter? So I kind of get the feeling that uh, she ain't in this location, like, whatsoever. It's gonna be a case where I have to, like, ask around, try and get, like, a proper idea of where the hell she actually is. Not seeing anything obvious uh, here, anyhow. anyhow. Rose Tooth Camp, Riften down there, of course, Valkyrie over there. No, I kind of get the feeling that uh, we got to do a bit of detecting here. So, find the actual client. I guess I better start talking to people. Best not cause any trouble on my watch. Yeah, you know, well, we got a missing girl, so you know I'm gonna I'm gonna talk to whoever I need to, guard. What are you doing that for? Oh, I'm on your I'm on your call, or smelt. Whoops. Yes. Hmm. Mm hmm. Hello. Yes. Hmm. Can't talk to I you either. Well, should we just go back in and maybe see Queen Grill, the mother, maybe? Really? Adara, put some clothes on you. Oh, wait. Adara? Is that the daughter? Oh. Okay. I thought we were dealing with a missing girl, and I thought you were going to be an adult. What are you, like 12? What the hell are you doing in ordering enchanted swords? Oh, you, you would appear to be the prankster then, I guess. Oh, I I'm sorry. I wanted to ask you something. See, the thing is... Uh-huh. <sighs> Mama doesn't like when I do magic, but I can't help it, I swear. So you can cast spells then? Yes, you heard correctly. So, can I come with you? You know, the college in Winterhold? That... Uh, maybe, maybe when you're older? I, I don't think I can really countenance uh, kidnapping right now. What? No! Whoa! Oh shit, she summoned a fucking Atronach. Okay, you can do that, and you did that by stomping. You appear to be a bit of a prodigy. Let's talk. Need something? Uh, how did you do that? I don't know. I I'm sorry. I can't help it. Please. I'm all alone. Maybe you can help me. Let's, uh, let's talk to your mother. You would do that? That's great. Thank you. Come on. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. You got a gift here, my child. My god. And if her speciality is, in fact, conjuring, she could be a, she could be a bit of a conjuring savant. In fact, she could be incredibly powerful, although we didn't get the level on that thing, did we? Better not be here to stir up any trouble. Yeah, yeah, uh, I am though. She did, did she? Hmm. What's going on? Yeah, very talented in the arcane arts. Well, I don't know. You think that's normal? It's evil, I tell you. Evil. She wants to join the College of Winterhold. The College of Winterhold. Really? Ugh, magic is nothing but trouble. You're talking to a mage. Come on, don't be that way. Nords don't like magic much. It's hard for many of the people here to understand. But honestly, I just want my daughter to be happy. Well, what am I supposed to do? Well, you're, you're kind of sounding rather reasonable. You do want her to be happy. She needs to learn to control her magic. It's dangerous otherwise. Let her join. I... I understand. Mother, will I go to the college in Winterhold? Really? Are you... are you sure? Yes. I am... well, uh, I... Look, I want you to be happy. So, go. But if you change your mind, you can always stay with me, okay? Oh, thank you! You're the best! I can't wait to learn from the mages in Winterhold. Well, this is it then. Look after yourself, Adara. You better come back to me. You hear? Thank you. Thanks for everything. Let's make sure so, we're just stay as safe. Bye, Mama. Brideling's happy. We're happy. Yes, sir, of course. Hmm. Actually, right. incredibly uh, wholesome. Stay safe. So, you're gonna follow me now, yes? Everything yeah, we have to escort her. Okay, let's yes, get her back. Sir. Fine, sir. Good, good. So, I went to... Jesus, we went to deliver a sword, we ended up coming back with a student. Kind of wild and not what I was expecting whatsoever, but we got a two kilometer trek ahead of us, so... Well, no time like the present, really, let's, uh, let's get on back.
And thankfully, during the daytime, uh, you know, it's going to be a hell of a lot easier. We this would have been nightmarish in the dark. Bit of a sprint on her, though. She's quick. Oh, shit. If I get this child killed, I will be annoyed. There we go. That's our electric Arcanoc. Oh my god, that thing is sick. My dear, you are terrifying. I can't wait to learn from the mages in winter. I just get so excited thinking about it. Uh huh. Yeah, let, let's uh, let's go. <laughs> if anything, um, yeah, I don't need to really defend her at all. If anything, she'll need to defend me. We are nothing in comparison to her. My God. I can't wait to learn from the mages in winter. I just get so excited thinking about it. So we could go uh, as the crow flies, go a little bit off-road. Uh, if we were to actually check the map, we were to check the roads uh, themselves, it would actually take significantly longer to make it back. We need to do a couple of loops. But having said that, following the road may not be the worst way to do it because we will actually pass a couple of trading posts. That we can actually use to either buy or sell goods, or at the very oh, or at the very least, uh, a rest. Come on, put him down. Yeah, where was your Atronach then, huh? <laughs> I hope you read what you hold soon. If if yeah, if I if I was to kind of like have a theory on it, um. The Atronach seemed to spawn based upon her emotional state. And I'm kind of getting the feeling that the types of Atronachs that come out are also based on her emotional state. So she got very frustrated. So nice Atronach came out. So I don't know. And she was uh, threatened uh, physically. So an electric Atronach came out. So I don't know. I, I, could, be, I could be wrong about that, but it kind of makes sense to me. It kind of looks like we're going to get more than our fair share of combat encounters on the way back. Hello? Who are you? Are you finished ogling the grotesque? I suppose I should be grateful you didn't simply attack me. I am one of the afflicted. I'd have been dead from this plague a year ago if not for Periite's protection. Oh, where are you going? Returning to High Rock. Our shepherd lost his way, and I fear Periite's wrath may consume those who remain with him. Kesh could tell you more. I, can't wait I just want out of Skyrim as quickly as possible. I just get so excited thinking about it. Well, the more excited you are about it, the longer it's going to take for us to get there. Just enjoy the trip. Still got quite a bit to go. It's at the Tower of Adara, I think. Actually, as well. Next combat encounter we come into, I kind of want to see what I can do with this, uh, this bad boy right here. Ooh. That's looking like a dragon, uh, burial site. In fact, what have we come upon here? Another one. I kind of need to remind myself, isn't there like about a hundred of these? Oh, I've absorbed enough to advance my skills. 108, oh wow. I just get so excited thinking about it. So level 16 now, if we keep going with this, we'll be level uh, 17, ideally by the time we get back. Let's take a look at the signs. So we're looking for Winterhold. Windhelm, no, Dawnstar. Well, Dawnstar too. Is there a one direct to Winterhold? It's gonna be more Dawnstar, right? So yeah, that away. Back to that, Dawnstar is just up ahead. I 
I see like shadows flapping on the ground like that, I instinctively look up. No, 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 it's okay. We got them. They got the wolf. Ah, my own people. So many refuse to talk to us. They call us thieves and smugglers. I am glad to see that you are not such I a one. I can't wait to learn from the mages in Winterhold. I just get so excited Mostly, thinking about it. Mostly, it is the Nords. They do not like outsiders in their land. And so we are forbidden to enter their cities. When they look upon us, they see only pickpockets and skooma dealers. It is most unfair. But we do our best to ignore them. Hmm. Not long in truth. I came to Skyrim after I found myself unwelcome in both elsewhere and Cyrodiil. I seem to have an unfortunate talent for getting myself involved in misunderstandings with the law. Rassad was able to look past that, and it was he who helped to set me up with a trade caravan. Now I work for him. Interesting. May your road lead you to warm sands. And by the look of this, uh, you know, a fairly large trade caravan at that. The road makes this one weary. So that'll be you then. I like your armor. Well, bandits harass the caravans at every step, but Khajiit usually scared them off. A few days ago we were ambushed. A nuisance, really. But many of the marauders had quick fingers. One of them stole my moon so amulet, given to me by my mother when I was just a cow. It is my only memory of home in this cold land. Well, I could get the amulet back. You are kind to offer. We believe the bandits are part of a group headquartered here. Be careful. I missed my amulet. But a life cannot be replaced as easily. Oh, no problem at all, Carjo. So you got the caravan then? Yes, I was hired to protect the others as we walked the roads of Skyrim. It is a thankless task, and I would rather be back home in elsewhere. But I have little choice. Akari freed me from a prison in Cyrodiil, and now I must repay my debt to her. A word of advice, my friend. Do not mix gambling and drink. Taken together, they will empty your pockets of every septim. Duly noticed. May the sun so keep you warm, thinking about it. even in this land of Don't people. worry, Adara, we'll get there soon. But it shall be next time. For now, we're going to put a cut in here. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the playthrough so far, and when we come back, we'll hopefully make it back to Winterhold in time for tea, and uh, ideally enroll her in. Or not. We'll see. Have a hell of a good night, and I'll see you soon for the next one. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.